Today we are going to see assembly visualization in SOLIDWORKS software. So how do we use assemblies visualization to sort the uh, sort the components uh, that we have used for the assemblies here uh, by giving uh, different uh, properties for that parts uh, that we use uh, while assembling the parts. So for that I need to open this uh, assembly that we have in the here in the SOLIDWORKS tutorials folder here. Uh, you will be getting the SOLIDWORKS tutorial when you install SOLIDWORKS uh, in your systems it will be by default you can just uh, see them by entering into this question mark here and uh, we'll be having a number of tutorials and you can practice most of them by the commands here uh, for that I need to open the model first uh, you can open uh, by just clicking here or else you can open the folders that you have in your drive that you have uh, uh, installed your SOLIDWORKS and uh, open the assembly so this is a food processor assembly basically the which is there in our system by default uh, as we need to do assembly visualization I need to enter uh, into uh, tools evaluate and uh, act assembly visualization option here so we have got the assembly visualization uh, of this uh, food processor assembly so uh, we'll first we'll sort it uh, by so we have to we can even change the color by just clicking on the mouse uh, button here we can change the uh, difference uh, colors as well by red should be upper blue should be down or it can be done as you want and uh, we can even uh, add colors in between by just uh, add slider uh, and uh, wait By the empty space here by just clicking uh, on that we can enter different colors as well uh, I've entered the yellow color so you can give different colors or different components as well and see how it uh, how we can segregate our uh, parts in the assembly so first uh, we can even hide the uh, hide the components here in our assembly by just uh, dragging this bar here as you can see most of the parts are hidden so that's how you uh, concentrate on single part and uh, segregate your uh, visualization assembly visualization here so uh, we'll uh, see the mass uh, so we'll segregate uh, First, this uh, segregate or sort sort this assembly uh, parts here by uh, property of mass first. So according to the mass, these are the this is how the parts has been uh, segregated. Let's see how the, according to the cost, uh, we have a, a quantity as well here uh, in these uh, parts uh, here. So we have uh, we have sorted the parts according to the mass that they have. So let's just uh, sort this uh, by cost. The cost that uh, will uh, it takes to purchase those parts that we have created. So this is how you segregate uh, your uh, depending upon the cost. And we can even uh, segregate uh, by uh, even. So uh, we'll be getting a cost. So we have entered the. We have all the cost here of the single component but we'll be having a different uh, n number of quantities as well for that we need to use a formula uh, in the same way I'll enter into more select the property of uh, cost and we'll use a formula cost into the, uh, uh, so I need to get uh, not for the single part I need to get the whole quantity uh, how many quantity that we are using in this assembly so for that I'll uh, use a quantity option here so we'll get the option here in this uh, formula by just clicking ok we can uh, sort this uh, visually and uh, uh, check the check the visualization here and uh, it will be easy when we use uh, assembly visualization and uh, you can see what are all the things are that there for example uh, when we have taken mass the most uh, the heavier one should be placed uh, 
uh, we'll be getting an idea heavier one or up or down where should we place according to the uh, mass uh, properties that they have and uh, it might be a difficult uh, problem when we produce the actual uh, assembly that we have created here in the model we'll be getting different uh, uh, problems when uh, producing these assemblies so that's how visually you can segregate our uh, options here so we can even uh, uh, by sort by make or buy options so uh, we need to make the parts or buy the parts so the that uh, that uh, segregation also can be done by just uh, taking the property as make or buy so we can uh, take that and uh, you can see the rubber control is not getting any uh, any make or buy so we can if we uh, sometimes we need to enter manually as well we need to buy so I'll, I'll enter this as a capital B so sometimes the colors uh, we might give a uh, different colors but uh, some uh, some will be very close so for that uh, we can uh, click uh, group identical and view the group identicals as well so this is how you use uh, this is how you use solidworks visualization and uh, visually we can uh, sort our things by using solidworks assembly visualization option in solidworks thank you let's meet in the next video if you like the video please like share and subscribe if you want to learn any courses regarding mechanical engineering please click the link in the description